gonna do a review of these Keto Girl and see what we think of them and if they pass the test for taste. On our quest for quick, easy, delicious food today, I have ordered online on Amazon some of this Keto Girl cereal. Many of you know if you watch my channel, I am a chronic dieter. I have been doing keto since 2018, but I've switched to a more low carb lifestyle now. I'm still on the quest to find quick, easy, delicious. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Karen Sing Beal. The first one is a farm girl nut-based cereal, low carb granola. This is a chocolate hazelnut with almonds, coconut, and Canadian oats. So this girl is actually out of Toronto. She makes, um, just, I'm just gonna tell you a little bit about this girl. I don't know much about her, but she makes this low carb pizza mix and honest to god you guys it's the best like i do a fat head pizza which you can see my fat head pizza recipe but honestly this is the best tasting for keto that i've ever had i'll do that some other day it's expensive though this stuff is so expensive it's like i think it's about 15 dollars canadian which is about 10 bucks us but that's that's pricey and then the second one is a farm girl nut-based cereal, keto crunch, salted caramel, almond, Brazil nut, and coconut. So these both say they're gluten-free, grain-free, low-carb, low-sugar, and the same, okay, on both of them. I'm just going to do them plain with the almond milk. I thought that these would be good maybe to eat plain or to put in your yogurt, like as ideas. Okay, so this is, the first one is the chocolate hazelnut with almonds, coconut, and Canadian oats. This is the first one we're gonna try. Okay, this is what it looks like in the bowl. So if we wanted cereal, we miss cereal on keto and low carb. It's like, okay, well, what's this taste like? Wow. Well, super crunchy. Okay. I can definitely taste the almonds and the coconut. I didn't think oats were keto. A little bit, I can taste the chocolate hazelnut. Mm hmm A little bit. Definitely taste it. I mean, look at that. That's a big chunk. I'm not a huge chocolate fan, but it's not overpowering. Next, the Keto Crunch Salted Caramel. This looks like real granola. This does look so like granola. So this is a salted caramel one. This would be good in yogurt, I can tell already. This is the kind of stuff I used to have with yogurt. Okay, what's this have in it again? Almond, Brazil nut, coconut, salted caramel. What it looks like. Mm. 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 
Bom, salted, tastes like nuts. That's what it tastes like. I don't really taste caramel. Mm -mm. Honestly, if you're really missing cereal, this tastes like granola a lot. And with yogurt, it would be delicious. This one has seven grams of carb. This chocolate hazelnut has eight grams. And look at that big piece. Hmm. Hold on a second. This bag, which is only filled to here, says it's 10 servings. Okay, so basically, this little tiny bit is considered a serving. Wow. Wow. This one's filled up a lot more. Now, you watch me open both of these. This one is only filled to here, and this one is filled up to here. Hmm. And this one says 14 servings. So the chocolate hazelnut has 14 servings and it's got more in the bag. And this one says 10 servings and it's only to there where my finger is. Okay? Okay, I would buy both of these and I would use them very sparingly and very limited. The taste is good, but the serving size is small and the serving size has to be small to have 10 and 14 servings and they're pricey. God, are they pricey. So, you know what? I'd buy them and I did buy them. It's not gonna be a meal. It's gonna be a tiny snack. That's what it's gonna be, a snack. I definitely prefer the salted caramel over the chocolate hazelnut. But I'm not a huge chocolate fan, so I like vanilla. There's my review, guys. I don't know. We'll see what you think. Let me know in the comments below if you've had them, if you eat them, if you've tried them, if you would try them. And I'm Karen Singbeal. Thanks for popping into my channel. And I'll see you on my next video. Take care, guys.